Yo yeah, guys, this is Game Boy Luke here and welcome finally to my Pokemon X Let's Play. Um a lot of people have been commenting commenting and stuff about which starters I should pick and which uh playthrough I should do. Um and a lot of people want me to do a regular walkthrough, just a regular playthrough. We're actually gonna play this game in uh, Spanish, by the way. Um no I'm joking. Um uh, the game game. I uh, know yeah, um People want me to do this in a regular walkthrough first before I do it in a Nuzlocke. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to play through this in a regular walkthrough. And here we go. This title screen is just mind blowing. Holy shit. Well, I have been playing Y, so I kind of know where to go and what to do or just adjust uh, things. But all I can say is that this, this, the soundtrack and stuff and everything is just so perfect. But for those of you that haven't played this, uh, let's do this. Um, welcome to the world of Pokemon. I am Augustine Sycamore, the Kalos region's very own Pokemon professor. The world of us. A little bit of that. Whoa. The, <laughs> the world of ours is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. These mysterious creatures can be found in every corner of our world. Some run across the plains, others fly through the skies, and others yet swim deep in the oceans. We live together with these Pokemon, lending our strength to one another to live and prosper. Let's get started with some quick questions. Are you a boy? Are you a girl? Actually, I'm a guy. And I'm blonde, so we'll go with this guy. Oh, I see! What Would you tell me your name? Okay, so let's go with... XAV, because if, for those of you that don't know, my... Uh, old YouTube channel was Xavian, and I kind of live off the whole Xavian screen name thing uh, when I'm not like on Twitter and stuff like that. So we'll go with XAV because that's kind of yeah, cool. Man, I look fly as fuck. So it's Zav then. Did I get that right? Indeed, it is. Success. Zav Trebian. What a fantastic name. I should probably give this guy a deep French accent. Oh, ha, ha. Zav, your adventure begins. Go and meet many people and Pokemon. Now let's go visit the world. <laughs> I'll be quiet. Um, <laughs> okay. Oh, wee oui, wee. Oui. No, enough of that. Okay, so we've got Fletchling flying around here. Hey, bro, this thing actually looks awesome. Like, I kind of want one on my team. Look at it. Look, just look at it. That TV, man. The computer. That bed, that room. I want this setup, man. So jelly. I look so f awesome in my pajamas too. Look, look at me. Look at me. Look at those PJs. Right. <laughs> oh, this music. It makes me feel so good. Okay. This is the Wii U. The game bag. It even has a screen. Oh my god. My fuck. Uh, a subtle advertising right there. So let's look in the mirror. Let's have a look in the mirror. Yeah, I look sexy as fuck. And suited up. Ready for my Pokemon's journey. And changed out of its pajamas. Okay, awesome. And you can actually. One thing that mind blew me, by the way, when you play this game is sit down. Oh my god, it's swivel chair. Oh my god. And you can also, like. Whoa. Whoa. Directional. <laughs> Diagonal directional stuff. Okay. Hey there, mom. Morning, Saf. You sure slept well? All rested up for the move? <laughs> It's about time you got going. Why don't you step out and say hello to the neighbours? I will do that, mother. And there's a fletchling. Also, when you speak to guys, you just like crouch down, which is awesome. It's TV though. It's TV. It's not even freaking. It's a documentary about Rykorn that overcame an injury to take on a big race and the girl who struggled alongside it. Oh, marvelous! Absolutely, simply wonderful. All right. Cool. So. We're going to walk out the door, and there's these two chicks. She's got freaking awesome shoes. Can I have your shoes, please? Okay, hi, guys. Welcome to Vanilla. My name's Serena. I'm your neighbor. And I'm Shauna. Great to meet you. Oh, guess what? We've come to get you. <laughs> I can't do voices. Like, <laughs> I feel so weird. Like, the, the esteemed f Professor Sycamore lives here in the Kalos region. I was told he has a request for five kids, including us. But I'm a little surprised he knows who you are, seeing as, you know, you moved into Vinaville, Vin Vin after all. We'll wait for you on the next town over. <laughs> you know what? We're going to get a Pokemon. Come on, hurry, let's go. So, yeah, a lot of people... Uh, said that they wanted me to pick Froakie and Charmander. Now, uh, I'm all up for this. 
but in my main run, I picked Froakie and Charmander. The one I'm playing through on, uh, on my Wii version. And to be honest with you, I don't particularly want to run the game with the same Pokemon. I mean, not, not, I'm not too bothered about Charmander, uh, because you get Charizard X in this game. So, um, I'll get Charmander, but maybe I'm thinking we should get um, Chespin instead of Froakie, because everyone's picking, from what I've seen, I've seen everyone pick Froakie, and loads of people pick Fennekin, wow, look at this 3D pan, man, it's awesome. Uh, and I haven't seen many people pick Chespin, so if it's okay with you guys, I'm going to pick Chespin, and then we'll pick Charmander as my Kanto starter. People are just talking about you, come on, have a seat. Yay. Friends, friends, Pokemon friends. This music's awesome. Wow, Shauna's description was spot on. So that this is Tiano. He's got some serious dance moves, and this is Trevor. He never misses a single question on his test, but he's a little shy. All right, nice to meet you. You know, it'd be uh, it'd feel like real we were closer if we call each other by nicknames. Can I call you X Meister? That sounds awesome. Lil X. What do you think, Trevor? It's gonna be big X in it. Big X. Big X. Um, now, I'm going to be stuck here for a while, because I really don't know what to call myself. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Should I call myself Professor X? <laughs> no, I can't do that. Um, nicknames, people. Um, geez, yeah, oh my god, I hate nicknames, they're the worst. Should I call myself Senpai? <laughs> oh no, okay, um... No, flipping tables. I have no idea. Um, let's just go with um. <laughs> oh, I, I'm so like picky when it comes to these kind of things. I have no idea. Um, let's choose. Um, <laughs> oh my god, I didn't be here for a while. All right, I'm back. Um, it took me forever to decide. Um, a couple of my friends suggested uh, my Japanese name, which is Ruku, um, but uh, he also because I, because I get called Luki a lot, so I'm gonna go with Ruki. Why not? <laughs> okay, so that's my nickname. I've been actually sat here for the last five minutes, so five minutes they I'm going to have to cut out. Do so you want us to call you Ruki? Okay, Ruki fits you perfectly. I'm sure we're gonna be great friends, so I'll call you that too. Hey, can we see the Pokemon now? I want to meet my partner soon. I know, right? It was such a cool feeling though, when Trev's and when I met our Pokemon. Hope you feel the same way we did. Alright, so like I said, we're going to pick Chespin. We're going to check them all though, just in case we find a shiny, because that would be hilarious. No, they're not shiny. Alright, so Chespin it is. Awesome. Alright. Chespin! Da -da 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 -da. And it names my Pokemon. Um, um, some of them I might tweet out, just in case if I get stuck. Uh, or I have just, uh, just random names that come off the top of my head. We're gonna call this guy. We're gonna call this guy. This guy Conker, because I checked the chestnut tree, horse chestnut tree. I used to pick collect Conkers when I was a kid. So, called Chespin Conker. Okay, my partner's Froakie. Well, you you two go together. Great. The two of us are just way a a too cute. Nice to meet you, Fennekin. I'm Serena. Because of you, I can be a real Pokemon trainer. Thank you. Well, she's so serious and stuff. God. Wow, this kid's just gonna hand us a Pokedex. Cheers, bro. Um, so you see, the Pokedex, the Pokedex I gave you is a high-tech device that automatically records your Pokemon when you encounter. The reason you get one is because the professional one is just, you got it, sorry. <laughs> That's my geek voice. Oh, lighten up, Trevs. You're way too serious sometimes. Um, Ruki, please take this with you too. It's a letter from the professor. He said you should give it to your mom. Sure thing, broski. His haircut's the best, by the way. Alright, we're done with the errand for the professor. I guess Trevs and I will go look for Pokemon. Let's go, Trevs! Alright. See you guys later. I need to go give the letter to Mother, so let's hop off the chair and dash back home then. Oh, and we have a cutscene. Rookie, wait! You're gonna be my opponent, my Pokemon dad battle in debut. Okay, little Froakie, it's our first battle. Let's win it with style. Alright, so we have our first battle. Just check out this 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 music though. Mm, 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 mm. This music is so catchy. Right. Conker, he looks awesome! Look at his little face! He looks so happy. Alright, Conker, show me what you got. Vine whip, go. 
Oh, this thing's using Growl. I think Vine Whip's actually a physical attack as well, which sucks for us, but... Oh my god, that attack was so awesome. He just like, ran in. <laughs> Run at me, bro! Oh, and Froki's gonna use Pound. He's gonna do nothing. It's crazy, because these Pokemon already have their stab moves, which they usually learn, like, level 6, 7, 8. So we already have our stab move, which is great. And I just rhymed. I didn't even realise. Good level 6. Yeah, conquer! Hey, Shauna, you're absolutely... Slapped. Hey, I wasn't done watching my cute little Froki yet. And we're just like, success! Fist pump! You're amazing, Rookie. Here, let me fix up your Pokemon. Yay! Say hi to your mom for me. Alright, so we gotta go deliver this letter real quick. And get to see this awesome screen thing. Yay! Alright, so this is our house here, right? Let's just head on in here quickly. Hey, mom! So, what did you and the neighbor's kids end up doing? Wait one second, Zav. Is that a Pokeball you have there? You got your very own Pokemon? Lucky you. How about that? You're a Pokemon trainer now, too. Congratulations. Huh? A letter for me? It says it's from somebody named Sycamore. What could it be? A love letter? Mum, you whore. Alright, French. That that French handwriting. Hmm, what do we have here? A request? Oh, I see. Zav. We've barely unpacked and all the kids, oh, all the kinds of exciting things happening. Okay, let's get you and your chest and ready for your journey. Mom? <laughs> Here you are, Zav. I even packed a change of clothes. My, what an unexpe unexpected turn of events. It's just like a sudden last burst of speed from a race in a right horn race. You made friends, you met your Pokemon, and now you get to take a lap around Kalos. Oh, and don't forget this. Yay, tile map. I still get lost in this place, so I'm actually going to set... The um, towel map as a key item, real quick. Uh, let's go there and register that. It's a lot annoying having to go into your backpack when you can just. There's this new awesome. Oh my god, Rhyhorn! Hey, Rhyhorn. <laughs> what a card. I guess Rhyhorn just wanted to give you a big send off for your journey. Well, it has known you since you were born, after all. Man, that is an old Rhyhorn. Why has it not evolved yet? Oh no, as I was saying, when you push the um, the uh, hotkey for key items in this game, you get uh, like four options usually. Uh, but seeing as I only have one item registered, I can only select one item. So, okay. Route 1, Vanderville Pathway, and uh, back to Aquacord Town. I think they're gone now, yep. Alright, so let's head this way. I'm pretty sure this shop here sells pocket monster balls. He does. We're going to buy 10 of those. And if we head across the opposite place, we can also buy potions. So let's do that so that we have something to heal our Pokemon up with, of course. Wait, I think I went in the wrong shop. Yep. All the places you can buy stuff have a different soundtrack. See? This one changed. Alright. We only sell the best potions. Yeah. Alright, let's buy all those. And now we're skint. No. No monies. We have no monies. Alright, let's head on this way. So today's actually been a pretty bumpy day, really, because um, I got my capture card and I was super excited and stuff, and I had to go run an errand for someone. And I, so I got my car, I went to drive off, and as soon as I drove off, my car broke down. And my cam belt, which is th something that helps... Oh, it's our first encounter. first encounter is... A Pidgey. Okay, well, in this run, I kind of want to use most of the new Pokemon, so I'm not going to capture this Pidgey, but... Anyway, as I was saying, uh, I, I took off in my car, and as soon as I switched gear, uh, my, my car just stopped, and it just turned off, and it wouldn't move, and I was like, what's going on? And it actually wouldn't turn back on, I couldn't start the engine up or anything, and it was really starting to make me worry. Uh, so me, me and my dad, I had to call my dad and get him over, and he helped me push the car into a parking space nearby, and... Um, I had to call out an um, a kind of emergency people, and they came along, and they looked at my car, and they told me that my cam belt had snapped. And the cam belt is, I don't, I'm not, I'm no engineer or anything, but it's something inside the engine that helps the gears and stuff move, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, and it, it just snapped, and without that, your car is, is screwed up. And so they towed my car to a garage, and they told me that it's going to cost about between 600 and 800 pounds to fix 
Now that's something like fourteen hundred dollars. <laughs> I don't have that kind of money, so I'm having to borrow money off my parents in order to pay for the car's repairs, um, which means I, I owe them more money. But what's ridiculous is that this car went into the garage like last month, and I spent five hundred pounds on repairing loads of other things, but not the cam belt. So unfortunately, I'm I'm going to be skint for a while. Luckily enough though, I already got this 3DS capture card, so let's just hope this doesn't break too. Touch wood. Touch wood. Wow, the Pokemon went inside the Pokeball? Dumb bitch, you gotta know that. Jeez. Oh wow, we, we oh, I forgot she gave us Pokeballs, so I just bought some. Alright, so we actually skipped that battle scene by talking about my shit day, so yeah, awesome. What other Pokemon can we catch in this grass? Can we catch Fletching, Fletching here? Bum, 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 bum. This music's awesome. Bunnel B! Hell yeah! We're just gonna keep grinding AC's things, I think. Also, one other thing, um, obviously, I'm playing this on a 3DS capture card. Or a 3DS with a capture card, rather. So, there is no speed up button. Period. I can't speed up anything. The only thing I can speed up is stuff I've recorded off screen. Um, without commentary, so I mean, if I did a grinding montage in between episodes, which I don't think will need to happen, because leveling up in this game is ridiculously easy. When I took down the Elite Four on my Y version, I was like 10 levels higher, so... Let's just encounter one more Pokemon and see what else we can find. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Another Bunnelby. That's cool, we can take down another one of these. Vine Whip to the face! Bam. Oh, wow. This thing's going to use Tackle on us. That's not fair. Actually it is, because we're totally destroying this guy. But it's Conk as a freaking unit. Alright. Uh, I really want to find a... Uh... Oh, hello. Please be a, ta a um, Fletchling, 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 Fletchling. Pidgey! I kind of want to get this guy, you know. <laughs> I'm tempted to, because it's kind of um, the irony. Because, you know, Pidgey's the first Pokemon you catch. Um, right, red, blue, and yellow. You can find Pidgeys and uh, Rattatas. So. so, who's this guy? Youngster Austin. Who do you think you are? Diggers are good. Oh my god. There's so many. Uh, this is probably one of the first uh, games that. Pokemon games. Excluding red, blue, yellow. Uh, maybe a bit of gold. And silver crystal that actually allows you to catch loads of Pokemon from previous regions because in Hoenn, in the Hoenn region, you could barely catch any of the you can't and Jota Pokemon, and in the Diamond and Pearl one, you could barely do the same. And that was kind of the same with Black and White, but until they, uh, uh, except for Black and White too, which allowed you to catch Pokemon from previous regions. And I'm really glad they did that because it just it kind of puts you off and they just throw new Pokemon. At you. I mean, new Pokemon are cool and all, but it's nice to be able to use your favourites from previous games, it's like they've they're like forgotten about. No one likes forgotten Pokemon, uh, forgetting Pokemon, so... Wow, did you hear that? I swear I just heard like a Fletchling cry in the background. Cool item. Antidote, that might come handy actually, considering we're in a forest, god knows what's in here. Um, oh, and we're encountering something. Caterpie! This is just like playing red and blue all over again. You find a find a Pidgey in the grass, and then you get to the forest and you fight a Caterpie. Memories. It's really kind of nostalgic, really. Right. Potion is just like remembering your first Pokemon journey and then looking at how far it's come now. It's crazy. It's crazy. So good, though. Whoa, I heard it again. That's cool. Hey, Serena, what are you doing? Santa... Oh, okay, I'm not going to... Ooh, what's going on here? This youngster trying to be the battle. Okay, cool. We're gonna walk in the grass and see if we can find any Pokemon. And we have Pansage! Oh my god! Hey there, Pansage. We don't kind of need you on our team, so... Yeah. I'm not gonna be capturing all the Pokemon, because I'm kind of already doing that on my Y version. This is just a playthrough. Uh, oh, hang on a sec, Rookie. What's going on? Look what I found, Rookie. I'll give it to you. I love puzzles. So, puzzle, sorry. So I watch everything more closely than you might think. Did you find a hidden item, you sneaky son of a... Son of a gun, you. Hey, bro. Come on, Scatterbug. Let's powder this punk. Whoa. 
you know who you're talking to? Youngster Jerry. <laughs> Youngster Jerry. I really want a Scatterbug because Vavillion is awesome. In my opinion, in my personal opinion, I think, I think, uh, I think, I think Vivillion or Viv Vivalon rather is a great, a great Pokemon. And I, um, I have one at the beginning of my playthrough, and I think it's a great Pokemon, especially a Pokemon that you can catch so early in the game. Uh, it's, it's, it's pretty beast once you level it up as well. So, what <laughs> we learn rollout. Hell yeah. Okay, so he's got a fletching as well. That's perfect, because we just let him roll out. Get roll out, son. Bam. Oh, one hit KO. Get done. Alright. Youngster Joey. Ha! You. You. Love your shorts. They're easy and comfortable to wear. Alright, what have we got in here? Give me a spupa. Oh wow, Weedle. Hey, Weedle. Conquer will destroy you anally with his rollout. Kapow. It's not hard, is it? Who's next? Who, who dares challenge the mighty Conquer? Whoa, look at Tiena in the background running. You never, that's the first time you see that guy run, right? Come on, give me some more Pokemon. We love Pokemon. Oh wow, really? Or we could just not encounter anything the whole time running through this grass, you know. Um, yes, got a bug. Hell yes. Right. Now, probably the best best moves to use on this would probably be Vine Whip because it's uh, not very effective against bug. Yeah. And uh, one more of those. Uh, hopefully one more of those won't kill it. What is it? Is it female as well? Awesome. I think Vivalon is more of a... Feminine looking Pokemon anyway, so... Oh no, I killed it! I must have got uh, low damage and then got high damage. That sucks. Let's find another one. So I kind of want Spupa. Super's awesome. I looked into her eyes. Go away, Weedle. Nobody likes you. Nobody likes you. There are so many different versions of uh, Vivalon though, like, I'm, it kind of it sucks you have to get them from different countries. I mean, it's a cool concept and all, but it just means I can only get the meadow form, because I live in... Oh, wow, Pan's here! Because uh, I live in the um, UK. It'd be cool if they were just, like, maybe, I don't know, random. Because 1 in 38, there's 38 different ones. I no, 38? It's 18 different ones, sorry. So, I don't know, it'd be cool to be able to obtain those. And Panpaw, we've seen all three of the monkeys in here. And they look so happy. Look, <laughs> oh. there's so many, it's like so many Pokemon in each route, though. It's the that's the great part. There's such a variety, a wide variety of Pokemon that you can capture. Go away, Pan Sage. Nobody likes you. Screw it. We'll just carry on walking through, and we'll see if we can find Spupa that way. All right. Do you have any Pokeballs? I might do. No need to be shy or anything. Uh, she probably wanted me to talk to her. I should probably do that. Last Anna. Come at me, Alana. Anna, Anna, Anna. Oh my god, Pikachu's cry is so awesome. La Vega, Vega! Alright. Let's use that Vine Whip. <laughs> it's so cute. I think it's great how they um added his cry in this game and stuff, but... I really think that they should have added Raichu's in as well if they were gonna if they were gonna add Pikachu's in they should have added Raichu's in because when he evolves it's just like I miss my Pikachu cry. And then I guess it's just Pikachu's the the uh, the mascot of Pokemon really the main mascot so it deserves a cry I guess. <laughs> there you go, there you go. Boom level nine. Hell yes. Gain that experience. Eep! I was the one who got shocked. Let's <laughs> see what you did there. Shocked Pikachu. Ha! Hilarious. Right, sorry. Here you go. Oh, just give me a Pokeball. Cheers. Thanks. Now I'm not shy. Is this another trainer battle? It is indeed. The best part about Pokemon battles is they can happen anytime with anyone and anywhere. Like in my basement. No. Um, Weedle. Well, luckily enough for us, we have the almighty rollout, which is cream bug Pokemon. So we're just gonna go with that. Come at us. 
Pow! But unfortunately, bug type is super effective against us. It makes the first gym kind of hard. Alright, who's next? Funnel B! I can't choose a move because we're going for a rollout spam, so. Never mind, it killed it in one hit. Cannot complain! Conquer gain some 39 experience. Level 10 already. See what I mean about how easy it is to level up in this? I gotta keep battling and training up my really awesome Pokemon. Cool, you do that. Let me go this way. Oh, it's an item. I've had another Pokeball! Hell yeah! Okay. Let's use one of those potions I bought. Just to be careful. I also love just what they've done in this game in general. Like everything is so much easier to do and quicker. Ooh. I really want to catch Pika. I think I think you can catch Pikachu in here as well. Oh, Fletchling! Do I want it? Do I want it? I want it. We're going to have like three Pokemon already, but I don't care because Fletchling is awesome. We need a fire type anyway. Oh, wait. If this kills it, I'll be mad. I'll be mad. I'll be so mad. All right. All right. You need to be captured. Get in my Pokeball. Let's use a Premier Ball on you. Because you're special. You're off as capture. Um. One. Two. Three. Click. Yeah. Premier Ball. Fletchling. Now all I need to do is think of a name. Um. I guess because you're a fire. You're not really. Uh. Well, you're a fire flying type. Um. You're kind of like a falcon, so or a hawk when you evolve. So should we call you? Um, let's call you. Uh, I'm trying to. Um, in in hawk, in fur hawk for inferno and. I mixed two words together, yeah, and smart. Ha! That's the worst nickname ever, right? No. <laughs> Alright, Infohawk. That's the worst nickname ever, but I, I don't even care. You can hate on me. But Infohawk and me are gonna go places. We're, we're, we're going right to the top. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Hey, Pansy, how's it going? And Infohawk is just gonna be like... Bro, what are you doing? Let's run away. Uh-oh, that's not good. Scratch gonna kill us. Nope, it's not. That's it, Pansy. You asked for it. You want to fight, you get in a fight. Come out, Conquer. Let's go. 1v1 me. 1v1 me. It's gonna use Scratch again. I don't even think it has its elemental fire move yet. Elemental fire move, yeah. That's, that's what I said. So we're just gonna go the roll out and kill it. Bam. Oh, wow, you're joking me. Whoa, that Leah, though. <laughs> That's really, really, you know, intimidating. <laughs> that cute little face. <laughs> That's what I thought, Pants here. Get out. And the hook's going to gain that experience. And... Actually, you can hit my Pokemon up, right? Yes, please. Thank you. Oh, almost there. So, you're the first to arrive. Looks like my new neighbor has some... Is someone with a lot of pet potential. Wow, that dance moves! Whoa! The way Pokemon move is just incredible! I want to show off some of that spirit when I dance. Tierno, could you think about something besides how your Pokemon move for once? We're all here, let's go to Santa Loon City! Oh, look at us, we're all walking together like friends! Like Pokemon friends! Yay, we're on Route 3! What are you all going to do? Well, well, I look for Pokemon, of course. The professor did ask us to compete the Pokedex, after all. And furthermore, different Pokemon prefer living in different places. To put it another way, it's a chance to find different Pokemon than the ones in the forest. I bet, I'll bet different Pokemon will use different moves. I sure want to see lots of moves. What are you going to do, Serena? I'm going to go tell in Santa Loon City Gym and challenge the gym leader. You see, Pokemon trainers find out how good they are by... Challenging the leaders of Pokemon gyms. Wow, you sure know a lot. It's because mom and dad taught me so much Here I have something for you guys adventure rules. I wrote down ten different tips each trainer should know. I don't need your tips I was born before this game was even programmed bitch. No, sorry Okay, so These guys are all stood here, so we're gonna stand in the middle 
OCD. I can't stand. It. We're gonna stand in the middle, and we're gonna end this episode off. So thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this. I'm sorry if it's kind of been kind of slow starting, um, but it'll pick up. I promise. Um, yeah, I'll catch you in the next episode. See you later.